code of laws to live by. I won't be wronged, I won't be insulted, I won't be laid a hand on. I don't do these things to other people, and I require the same from them. Well, I love the one-shot mages, I live the two-shot breeze. When I see ya, I'll pee 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 ya, spanking noobs, that's my favorite cheese. Bros, do it in the dark. It isn't always being fast or even accurate that counts. Being willing. I found out early that most men, regardless of cause or need, aren't willing. They blink an eye or draw a breath before they pull a trigger. I won't. Hey all, Sparky Pipes here. Uh, these are two pipes I just got done. Uh, the first one is going to be for Mark. Old Pipe Pops Jr. or Making Change. Uh, he asked if I could make a gorilla pipe. Uh, I was kind of hesitant because gorillas, as you know, are real close to humans and so their character is really hard to do. But we thought we'd give it a shot and this is what we came up with. Hope you enjoy. Well, I love the one shot mages. I live the two shot breeze. When I see ya, I'll pee 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 ya. Breaking news, that's my favorite cheese. Rose, do it in the darkness. Rose, do it where the sun don't shine. Rose, with the little drop of poison. Rose, do it from behind. Yeah. <laughs> gonna creep inside your back door. I wear blood and leather On sight the nether blade Chop, chop the level seven wall I'm gonna take him out With my dish and play Roll, do it in the darkness Roll, do it where the sun don't shine Roll, with a little drop of poison Roll, do it from behind, yeah next pipe is a practice pipe. Everybody knows I use Plateau Briar for all the pipes I sell. Well, I buy Ebishon uh, blocks to actually practice drilling. Uh, I had one block left and it was really nice green and I told Ray, Hobby Pipes, I really want to do a practice pipe out of this. I think it would be really, really nice. And he said, hey, send it to me. <laughs> so after talking with him a little bit, uh, we ended up deciding to go with an Eskimo style pipe uh, to really show off the green. And so we started off with that shape. Uh, we lengthened the tobacco chamber so it's a full size bowl. And then he said, hey, can you do a reverse calabash? And even though I don't do them, I thought, hey, it's practice pipe. So we went ahead and made this a reverse calabash, which really thickened the, sh the shank up quite a bit. Uh, to keep the lines going back, we double stacked the acrylic. So it's actually two pieces of acrylic thick. And then just to, to test myself, uh, when I did the Morrison 10, and if you notice, it's actually, the top of it is canted backwards a little bit. So it's not straight, uh, which was a very interesting uh, uh, trial on that. And it really learned a lot on how you can do Morrison tendons and how you can actually change the angle on them. Really good to learn experience. I really want to thank Ray for... Uh, getting with me and uh, accept these up then that I was pretty much just trying new things with. I mean I really appreciate him being kind of a guinea pig and just saying yeah send it to me so hope you guys enjoy have a good one do it from behind Ha 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 ha!